Hey, I want to make a video. I'm, like, really confused. Um, I'm someone who's always just been himself, and just, there's so much in the world that's awesome and I'm inspired by, but I, I never get lost in my inspirations, you know? I never, like, see, I'm like, oh, that's so cool, and now I want to be that. Like, no, I'll be like, okay, that's cool. And I don't really think much of it, but if it inspires me down the line, it inspires me down the line or whatever. But, like, I never want to, like, completely mod myself after anything, you know? And there's so much in the world that can inspire you, and there's just so much you can do and whatever. But, like, I feel like people need to focus on finding themselves and understanding themselves and try to, instead of trying to fit in with others and trying to be like others, I'm seeing it so much and it's making me really sad. Like, I don't understand it. It really confuses me because I've never really been like that. Um, can't expect for everyone to be like me. And, you know, others can't expect for others to be like them as well. But just from my perspective, it just kind of confuses me, you know, because I see a lot of people who, you know, I had a lot of, um, what would be the word? I'm sorry, my English is getting really bad day by day, um, nah, that's not the word, um, <laughs> I don't know the word, I can't think of the word, I can't think of the word, but I had a lot of, like, I don't know, I just had, I expected a lot of them, you know, I just expected a lot of them, um, but, you know, everyone's not on the path of, of, of a master, a mastery, and being a master is not an easy thing. It's, it's, it's to master yourself and to understand yourself and to be your own individual self. There's only one of you, you know, so you don't want to ever try to, to be like anyone else. You can be inspired by people that can help you understand yourself more, you know, and expand yourself, but you should never get lost into your lost by your uh your inspirations or anything like that i see so many people out here who have like identity crisis and like identity issues and usually i notice the people who have identity issues it's usually people who are always around other people right like they, they're, they're never by themselves or they're never with people who just encourages them to be themselves they're usually around people who make them feel insecure or make them feel like they have to be a certain way just be you man like like the the way of being a master, like, the route of, like, this is something that confuses me, too. Like, not really confuses me. It's just kind of, like, I don't live life accordingly to, like, human, like, laws and human, like, customs and rules and stuff like that. Because I can just see through a lot of it. You know, a lot of it, you know, is valid. But a lot of it isn't valid, you know. So everyone doesn't really have a good, like, uh, moral compass and and you know, understand what they should do, what they shouldn't do, what's right, what's not right, all these different things, you know, I always say you just shouldn't really, you shouldn't harm others, uh, and you shouldn't harm yourself, and you should just do things that are just, that just feels good to you, but not things that hurt other people, you know, just be yourself, Um, you know, for me, like, I don't really have any problems just being me, and just enjoying my life and you know if people don't really like me for who I am I don't really care that much it doesn't really bother me you know I just like to be myself um and I think that's really important to to do like I'm seeing so many people who are trying to force themselves to be like someone else you know just so that they can be accepted or whatever but you don't really want to be accepted by anyone but yourself you know it's hard to create the friendships that are meant for you and to have the love that's meant for you if you're trying to always please everyone else and trying to make yourself mold into uh, a certain demographic or, or whatever. You want to focus on just being you and focus on just living life accordingly to how you truly want to live it, you know? Um, make sure it's not low vibrational, make sure you're not hurting people and stuff like that. We're not here to hurt another, we're here to help another. Um, but yeah, um, just live life accordingly to you and don't focus too much on, you know, on trying to impress others and stuff like that. You know, most people are really cowardly. I'm, 
I'm often alone. I, I don't really like to associate myself with people whose vibrations are too low or people who just don't resonate with me. I'm fine with being alone if I have to be alone. I'd rather be alone and be myself rather than be surrounded by a bunch of people uh, and not be able to be me. So I think it's really important to value yourself and to just be yourself. We're here to be ourselves. We're not here to to conform to all this bullshit. All this bullshit's going away because it's, it's not natural. It's, it's really not natural. A lot of this shit's not natural at all. So try your best to see through the illusions and be yourself, embrace yourself. There's a lot of cowards out here who are, you know, afraid to just be themselves and just embrace themselves and stuff like that, you know? Like, if you like, like, there's people who are afraid to just, like, whatever. Um, But on another note, it's really good to also keep your vibrations high because... There's people who are being themselves, but, you know, their vibrations are low. So your vibrations are low. People aren't going to want to associate with you, you know, because at the end of the day, a lot of us don't want to be in situations that are just not good for us and around people whose energy isn't good for us. So it's really important to also work on your energy and get your energy up, too, because, you know, masters don't really like being around all that, like, low vibrational stuff, you know. I work hard on myself, so I expect others to work hard on themselves as well if they want to be a part of my life. Um, I think it's fair, you know, if I'm working hard, I expect for people around me to as well. Um, if I'm being myself, I expect for others around me to be themselves as well. So, um, yeah, just be you, man. A, a lot of people are too drawn to the validation of others. Um, me, I see through it. You're trying to get you know, validation from people who don't know themselves. Instead, learn who you are. Take time to know who you are. You guys are living too fast, man. Living way too fast. Slow the fuck down. Understand yourself. Love yourself. Appreciate yourself. Tend to yourself. Heal yourself. Know yourself. Because if you don't tend to yourself and love yourself and appreciate yourself and be there for yourself, who's going to be there for you and do that for you? Nobody. Because you came and be with the people who are meant for you because they can't really, they can't, it won't work out because they like you for who you are, for who you are naturally. But you guys can't get along or, you know, be together or whatever because you're repelling them away because you're not being who you're supposed to be. You're not being your natural self. You're being someone else because you're trying to fit in with all these people, you know. You have all these people around you, but do they really love you? You know, you want to be around people who actually love you and care about you and that starts with yourself man you gotta be there for yourself you gotta love yourself you gotta appreciate yourself and be there for you um and understand you know life is an individual journey and then be aligned with people who um who make sense for our lives and stuff like that and we coexist with them but you know you should never try to um compromise yourself for others you shouldn't you should focus on being you enjoy your life man life is meant to have we're meant to have fun and enjoy ourselves what's the point of living if you can't even be you you know i know it's a lot of like deception and illusions out here but you just have to be strong in yourself and be bold to just be yourself and just be you you don't need to be anything else but yourself you know and, you know, the way to get true love in life is by being you. You know, you got to be you. That's the only way you can have true friendships and true relationships and romance in your life. By being your authentic self. Because if you're not your authentic self, then you won't really know who's meant to be in your life. Because... In order, because in order, the, the right people in your life, you want them in your life because you can resonate with them. And you can resonate with them because your character um, can reflect their character and, and vice versa. So it's really important to, to know yourself, man. You got to know yourself. You got to because people will just destroy you if you don't. So it's really important to take your time and everything like that. Um yeah, that's just something I wanted to say because, you know, I care about people and I want to see them, you know, 
have fun and enjoy themselves. You know, it's not my responsibility to chaperone anybody or to tell anyone how to live or whatever. No one told me how to live, so I don't really... I don't really see why I have to go out my way all the fucking time to get other people's lives together. That's like my childhood, you know, me as a child trying to, to navigate my family and, and help them live and, 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 and tell them what they should do, what they shouldn't do. No, for me, I had to fucking figure that shit out on my own. So I don't understand why other people can't either. If you want to live, you need to figure shit out for yourself. You know, you can get help and not guidance. I don't mind giving guidance and stuff like that, but I'm not going to hold people's hands and shit and try to get them to where they need to be. you got to take responsibility for your life and get your shit together. It's really important. Um, But, yeah, I just want to say that because, you know, like, I just don't understand. There's so many people who I see so much in, but they're not taking responsibility for their lives. You know, it comes from, I don't know, it's it's a personal thing. You got you to gotta figure that out on your own. But, and usually when, it never really works like that anyway, when you try to, try to fix somebody and stuff like that. I tried that so many times throughout my life. Uh, that person has to want to fix themselves, has to want to fix themselves. Um, and, you know, wake up and, and understand the reality of life and snap out of things and, and, and you know, be themselves and, you know, and create an, an ideal life for themselves, you know. Destiny is a spectrum. Uh, so is fate, you know. There's so many different things that can happen in your life. It depends on the path that you take and you can switch your path at any given time in your life. So it's really important to understand that, you know, as long as you're alive, you can always change your destiny and your fate and you can, you know, create a better life for yourself. You can renew yourself and all these different kind of things. So understand that. Um, but, you know, really value your life. I really hope you guys value your life. You know, there's so many people out here who wish that they can keep living or that they um, can have the things that you have. So, you know, never get too lost in, in the 3D world. You know, all of it's pretty much fake. Just enjoy it. Don't get too lost into it. You know, be you and stop trying to be others. Just be yourself. But, um, yeah. And like I said, you know, it's, I'm just a genuine person. I'm nice. I like to help people, but I'm 25. I'm a child. Uh, I'm not trying to raise people. You know, I, I like to give advice and everything like that. And, all these different things but like i'm not like i don't have the patience i'm 25 i'm trying to figure my shit out i'm trying to create my own world and everything like that so i don't really have patience to deal with people who are still like in this like toxic like thing like i've been having to deal with that for 25 years when since i was a child i always just wanted to get going you know but since i was a child i always had to just deal with all this like stress and bullshit for my family so like for me i'm not tolerant with it i'll give advice and everything but like i'm not dealing with it i don't want to so yeah so i, I just really hope you know people can really you know find a way for themselves because i believe in it but you have to believe in it you know it's not up to me it's not my life it's yours you know you have to want what you want and you have to put the work in towards getting that i believe in you all i wish you all the best i wish you all you know blessings abundance prosperity health you know healing um peace of mind and i hope that you find yourself and be yourself and and everything like that i hope you get all the love that you need in life and renew yourself you can renew yourself at any given time you know you don't like the way your family is you can create a new one you know, you you got to better yourself. I believe you all. Be good out there, please.